it's Jamie, the Urban Wine Buff, and welcome to Alphabetically Wine. Now today's letter is the letter B, so I'll be discussing body. Now body is basically how light or how heavy the wine feels in your mouth when you take a sip. It's that simple. So you have wines that um, feel really light and watery and delicate and lean when you take a sip. Those are considered your light bodied wines. And then you have wines that are really bold and deep and full when you take a sip. And those are considered your full bodied wines. And then you have the wines in between that just flow in between the light and the, the, the full. And those are considered your medium bodied wines. There are a few factors that contribute to a wine's body. I want to first start by saying that um, some wine grapes are just going to produce full-bodied wines just based on the anatomy and the biology of the grapes. So you have those grapes that are really dark and have really thick grape skins. Um, when those uh, grapes are picked and harvested or, and are being processed, and they are sitting on the juice, they impart all this character and texture and flavor to the wine. So in those cases, it's based upon the wine grape itself that determines how full the body of the grape is going to be. Um, another thing that contributes to um, wine body would be the alcohol content. So I would say any alcohol that's more than 14% alcohol is generally going to be a full body wine. Um, the ones that are like less than 11 or 12 percent it's going to be your light body wines and of course the in between one is going to be your medium body. Um, and then one more other thing that can contribute to the body of the wine is how the winemaker chooses to age the wine. So oak aging or um, aging the wine in oak barrels definitely adds texture and body um, to wines more than would, would have normally been there. So some winemakers use oak aging as a way to add body and add fullness to their wines. Okay, so if you're looking for a light bodied wine, you might want to try something like a Sauvignon Blanc, a Riesling, a Pinot Noir. Um, some of the medium bodied wines would definitely be something like a Merlot and even something like what I have now, I can tell that the winemaker kind of added their own flair to this one. This is a Pinot Gris from Willamette Valley, Oregon. Um, this is a medium bodied Pinot Gris. This is what I taste and what I feel when I take a sip. So I would consider this a medium bodied um, wine. And for your full body wines, you want to go with something definitely a Cabernet Sauvignon. That's just off the rip gonna be full body. Like that's a classic expression of Cabernet Sauvignon, big bowl full. Um, Chardonnays can sometimes be full. Um, those Chardonnays that are from California, particularly like Napa Valley, Russian River Valley, um, those Chardonnays that have been aged in oak barrels, heavily oaked, um, those wines are really bold and big and full. So in that case, that's one of the ones that the, the winemaker's choice has determined the fullness of the grape. So I particularly love full-bodied oaky Chardonnays, but Chardonnay is one of those grapes that can, it's really versatile, but I'll get to that another day. Um, another full-bodied grape, let me tell y'all about this. Another full-bodied wine is Zinfandel. Yes, Zinfandel. And let me, I need to cut right here and just let you know that Zinfandel is a red, bold, full bodied wine. That's the classic expression of Zinfandel. This white Zinfandel that y'all be talking about, that's not the business. Get you a classic Zinfandel and it'll change your life. It changed mine. Like, Zinfandel is so big and bold and sexy and regal. It's like, I like my men. Like, I literally call Zinfandel my boyfriend of wine, but okay. I'm, I'm done ranting, but I'm just letting you know just how deep it is. Like, for real, for real. Um, <laughs> but anyway, so as far as body goes, um, I hope you learned something from me today. I also wrote a piece a little while ago. It's on my blog. Um, theurbanwinebuff.com 
um, the name of the piece is Get Me Bodied and it, it, it explains body um, like this and I, I use some other examples as well so go check it out um, but let me also know like what do you think about body do you like full body ones light body ones somewhere in between I like them all depending on my mood um, but I encourage you to go out and just try one the next wine you taste just take a second to just um, hold it in your mouth before you swallow it and just analyze is this light body medium body and to, until then though um don't forget to like comment subscribe follow all of that and meet me at the next video let's go